Hey guys, it's been a while, but I'm back with another video, and today I'll be talking about what I learned from doing for 30 days straight. There's a challenge that I was doing over on Discord, um, can, which you can also join, which is in the link in the description, as well as Instagram, where I was drawing every single day for the 30 days of January, and I was doing this as an experiment to find out whether there's a significant growth that you can be able to see when you draw for 30 days and here's what i learned so if you have the short answer the answer is yes i did improve but it wasn't that extraordinary of an improvement it's just like minor minor improvements in some things like i felt more comfortable during some certain features that were probably tougher for me to draw back in the days and other factors that influenced my art were starting to feel a bit easier to get around when it came to drawing them. But something that I did notice over the 30 days is that there was a change in the attitude that I went into every piece with. There are some days where I would end up having a long tiresome day I ended up having to draw the end of the day or something because like I wasn't around and that was a different result on my art, you know. And some things like when I have a really free open day just to do anything, I would find myself having more time to do something worth being proud of, you know. So it was a long process, it took a long time, but it was worth it because I did notice improvement and here some on the screen are some of the things that I drew during the month. As I said, I did this challenge over on Discord and we were doing it all together. Around 500 of us plus, I don't know how many we were, we did this challenge together and it was, it was fun. Everyone had different results, other people noticed a significant growth. Others didn't notice so such of a significant growth like others, but at the end of the day, yes, there is an improvement. Towards the beginning of the challenge, I started out going out on my way to tackle the hardest things that I couldn't possibly do before. Things like perspective, I couldn't draw bodies in perspective. I had an issue with that, so I settled to drew some portraits, some pictures if you may call them, with some foreshortening involved. As the days narrowed down, I found myself tackling other things that I probably was having some issues with. Things like perspective. I was still having an issue with like now perspective, perspective, the real real perspective of buildings and stuff. I was trying to get that down and grasp that knowledge. And it was small but some of these drawings were out from things that I would learn out throughout the day, plus my previous experiences with art. So I went into this challenge. I wasn't a beginner, of course. I've been drawing for some time, but I'm not a pro either. So I do believe that for certain skill levels and skill differences, there will be a different result as to every person's abilities and skill level and i feel like at the end of the day it's up to you to find out whether you will actually improve yourself by actually trying it out just by doing something every day also another thing that i did was i made sure that i wasn't using reference every single day not saying that you didn't use reference if you want to do yours actually i advise using reference it's really good for learning new things and all. but i just felt like i wanted to challenge myself and put my creativity to the test and see what I could actually do when I was given just nothing but a paper and pencil. Otherwise, that's all that I learned from the 30 days of doing every single day. We did notice improvement and that's all that I think we really wanted to note down. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you did enjoy it, please do feel free to like and subscribe to the channel as well if you want to take part in these challenges you can just join the discord which is linked in the description or to come join me on twitch just come around say hi yeah that's all i got to say 
Thanks so much for watching and take care.